Hey, it's Juan for PedaltonFX.com. And uh, like any bass player, electric bass player, uh, we're a crew of dudes that like to go low, deep, and we're always on the search for the perfect low end and even further than what our instrument can do. And so I've always been obsessed with octave pedals and sub pedals because that brings us into that realm of low end that you know we we all want to end up living in and you know we definitely covered on my website the meat box dod's meat box uh, there's the boss oc2 there's so many ampeg sub blaster um, there's so many octaves manic makes a great uh, sub harmonic pedal and um, but the, i remember you know in my initial searches like i i mario caldado jr who records the Beastie Boys, he was the one who told me about the DBX subharmonic and he said he would use it on the Beastie Boys and so I bought one it was a DBX unit about this big in a wood box and I blew speakers up with it. It's just awesome but it's also, you know, like is it in a pedal form? And um, so then after that it was always on a search for how can I get that subharmonic sound and I remember when Ashdown amps came out, I had checked out their their bass amps, and and though I, you know, I like their amps, I think they're they're fine. I I, I prefer Ampeg, but they did have this one thing on their amps, the sub harmonic knob, and I when I would use it when I was checking out their amps, I go, man, that's that sound, that sub harmonic low end, and I <clears throat> I loved it. I even. Um, you know, I even bought one of their octave pedals because I thought it was the same thing that came on that amp. Um, and I've actually done a review of that pedal as well. And it isn't, that's just an octave pedal. And so I was looking at Ashdown's uh, website and I saw that they make the Octodose, which is Dr. Green Octodose by Ashdown. And it says on their website that it's that sub, -har uh, sub harmonizer that was found on their amps. So I, I wrote to them, I said, could I, you know, could you send me one so I could do a review on it? And they were nice enough to do so. And though I don't know if it sounds exactly like the ones on the amps, I maybe, maybe it's all in the room and everything. It is interesting. It is, it's a subharmonic pedal and you can hear all these different harmonics getting grabbed when you, when you hear the pedal. It's a pretty simple pedal. It's just got a direct signal, which I'm not going to use. Um, and it has the octave and I'm going to just blast the octave full up so you can hear what it sounds like and I'll, there'll be some samples and you let me know I'll, you know, there's not much I can really do as far as knob turning I can, I'm going to blend in a little of the direct but I personally don't ever play that way I, I like having the, the pedal full on and, and making my bass sound something completely different this is the octodose mm -hmm.